Once you got your brake drum and hub fully installed onto your front Dana 25 axle, now we have to install the lockers onto the hub. And to do so, we'll have to shim your lockers so you get no free play in your axle. So your axle is right here and don't want it to be moving in and out. So in our application, we have eight shims piled up and that will allow no free play. And we'll put a snap ring on the very end and that will make sure your axle doesn't move. And one trick is I would use a shorter bolt just so you can suck in your locker into your hub so you can gauge how much shims you need. We'll put some multi-purpose high temperature bearing grease right into your front lockers and this will help everything move better. Once everything is greased in your worn locking hub, now we will install all 12 bearings and we'll just push them in making sure everything is nicely greased. All 12 bearings are now in the slot in your worn locking hub and now we will continue to install this onto the hub. Also put a light coat of grease on the teeth on your other part of your worn locking hub. The next step is pull out the bolts that we use to hold on our first part of our worn locking hub. Remove these. Now we can gasket seal this part right here and put the other part of our worn locking hub on top to engage with these teeth. Before you apply your gasket sealant to this face on your worn locking hub, make sure to acetone both surfaces where your gasket sealant will be placed. And also acetone this surface or your other part of your worn locking hub. Apply your Permatex former gasket number two on the surface of your first part of your worn locking hub. Also apply your Permatex number two former gasket to the surface of your worn locking hub. With gasket sealant now applied to both surfaces, now you have to stick on your gasket. We'll just line up the holes. With your gasket sealant applied to both surfaces and your gasket installed, and now we'll put our bolts right through everything, and then we'll just tighten this to secure. Install all six of your bolts. The last step is to torque all six of your bolts to 20 foot-pounds. That will put even pressure on your gasket, and we'll just tighten into crisscross pattern. So we'll start from this side, go across, and then work all the way around, and then that will be how you get your front worn locking hub installed.